Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest XI. Last time on Dragon Quest XI, we found the town of Sniffelheim completely frozen over after an attack by an icy witch. A local queen asked us to go after the witch's magical beast and try to find out what happened to the Helidoran soldiers that went before us. We tracked down the beast and felled it, even saving Sir Hendrik in the process. Not that he seemed particularly grateful for the help. Now, it seems Dagenmar has overexerted himself and collapsed from the cold. Where do we go from here? Let's find out. This is Dragon Quest XI. Yo, 007, welcome back. How's it going, man? How's your night going so far? Would be nice for hot days. I know, right? We need a. Uh, we need her during summer. Some fucking free air conditioning, right, Festa? <laughs> Oh shit. All right. So, yeah, we're back at the cabin. We're in the bed that doesn't belong to us that we jizzed in earlier. All right, here we go. Ah, so you are finally awake. Are you feeling better, friend? Sure. Good, good. You have your companions to thank for that. Such caring comrades are a rare gift. Ah. Uh. Ah, but forgive me, I have not introduced myself. I am Snorri, scholar Snorri. of the arcane arts. I came here to investigate the origins of the Wicked Witch, who froze Sniffelheim solid. Dude's name is Snorri? Really? It was luck, and luck alone, that caused me to be away from the city when she first appeared. Or well, I, too, would have been turned into an icy statue. I feel you, 007. This week has been kind of draining. Your friends tell me the Queen has asked you to eliminate the sorceress. If it will help you in your quest, I will be happy to share what I have learned. The witch's name is Kristalinda. Long ago, in the Age of Heroes, a mighty mage imprisoned her within the pages of an enchanted grimoire. The book was hidden away safely in the Royal Library, an ancient archive built by the founders of Sniffelheim to house the combined knowledge of all humankind. Oh my god, you guys remember when we first went to Sniffelheim and we found the queen reading the book? I bet that little bookworm accidentally unleashed her, right? Because she had been queen for, what, nine months before all this happened? And then this has been going on for three months? I bet you anything she accidentally did this. See? That's what happens, chat. That's what happens when you read books. If you read books, bad things happen. No, I'm just kidding. That's, like, really terrible thing to say. <laughs> Having learned this... I tried to go and see the book for myself. Alas, the library was swarming with monsters, and I was forced to retreat. Oh, hello. Up and about, are you? Thank goodness for that. Indeed. You are well on the way to recovery thanks to your young friend here. It is plain to see that Veronica cares for you very deeply. Put a sock in it, Snorri! <laughs> there is no need to be embarrassed, my dear. Anyway, your timing is perfect. I had just finished telling your friend all I had learned about the witch. I'll get straight to the point, then. We're taking Snorri here back to the library so he can look for clues on how to beat her. It is high on a plateau to the east of here, but we must make our way around to the south before we can reach it. Shall we? Uh, to the east of here, we must make our way around to the south. Oh, that's the other place. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know where to go. Oh, no. Oh, it's that over there. Well, shit, never mind. I, I was about to go, like, way out of our way to some other place. All right, let's go. Never trust a, a book by its cover has never been so true. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's true. Let's get on a horsey horse. 
All right, let's go. There are actually probably something over here. I want to see what's over here real quick. I bet you there's something over here to find. Probably a mini metal all the way out here. Whoa, what the fuck is that? The fuck? The fuck are those things? Glimmer grass and silk blossom. This is something we can apparently ride. Let's see what this is all about. Space invaders? Instead of space invaders, it's space invaders. All right. Uh, also, I just realized I did that entire boss battle while I was blocking the fucking move selection. I'm sorry about that, chat. I'm sorry about that. Let's see if I wisely. I'll just have them figure this out while I'm talking to you guys. Yeah, Aiden, I'm really excited about your book. I really am. I'm gonna have to figure out like when I'll have time to read. I might actually score one for the good guys. Hmm. Usually I, I read before I go to bed, but that'll take me fucking forever to get through it if I did it that way. Um, we're gonna ride this guy. We're gonna ride this guy. Um, wonder if this like helps us get to somewhere we otherwise wouldn't be able to go. Um, oh yeah, see like this. Like that. Yeah, there we go. Wait, what does this say? All right. Got to learn to read? Yeah, okay. All right. All right, Dammy. Oh, by the way, guys, um, I think I've decided that... Oh, that's such a waste. I hate how he does that. I think I've decided that it's not going to be this Saturday that we do our two year celebration, but next Saturday. I need a little bit more time to prepare. And I don't want to do it half ass. Thank goodness. So I've been streaming on Twitch for two years and we're going to celebrate it not this Saturday, but next Saturday. I'm just pushing it back a little bit, you know? I wonder if this is a shortcut. I bet it is, actually, now that I'm thinking about this. I bet if we didn't get this mount and we didn't break that wall of ice, we would have had to gone all the way south. But I, I bet this is like a secret path up to that area. I guess we'll find out in a moment. Or do I half ass if you know it? Oh, wow, no. I'm not gonna do anything that uh, gets me banned, all right? Or will I? I don't know. How low will Dagon Mars stoop? Find out this weekend. <laughs> Mirror stone! We can fucking make the shit! We can make the shit for the, uh... The lady at the girls' academy or whatever the fuck. Oh, get wrecked. You see that shit? Get wrecked! Oh. Way to the Royal Library. Yeah, let's go this way. Is there something up here? I bet there is. Yep, there sure is. Let me get this real quick. More mirror stone. Wow, there's a lot of it here. Let's go all the way. All the way. Waist height? That's your guess. <laughs> So yeah, my my plan basically for that two-year celebration is gonna be a bunch of multiplayer games. Um, I do have a preference for games that everyone could participate in, so that would be games where like chat can interact with the game, and then we'll also do things that you know are multiplayer games that don't cost a lot or that most people already have. So like we might start with Cluster Truck and then maybe move on to like Stick Fight or something like that. Uh, Festive, I'm pretty sure you played Stick Fight with us last time, right? I think it'd be fun to uh, play that with you again. You'll be in California? Oh, uh oh, I'm gonna rob your house now. Just, just out of spite, just cause you told me not to, Ants. I'm gonna go rob your house. 
JK Twitch popos, I'm kidding. I am not advocating for illegal behavior. Just sleep in your bed. <laughs> We're gonna be like, uh... That one guy, right? The cabin in the woods here, where we uh, slept in the guy's bed. Anti-freeze earrings? Oh, that's probably gonna be useful. Hold up. That's probably gonna be useful. So, dragon scale versus anti-freeze earrings. It does lower our defense and attack by a lot, actually. Hold up. Ice damage taken reduced by 10%. That's actually not as pog champ as I thought it was. Hmm. Oops. Oops. Oh, fuck. All right, anyway, let's go. Haha, <laughs> ants, that's funny. Nightwolf, hello Nightwolf, how are you? How's it going? Uh, when you say you need to learn to read, you mean you have a lot of trouble just sitting down reading? You get distracted easily, yeah. I, I feel you on that. That's pretty common, actually. You need to have some focus, you know? All right. Yeah, there's a lot of shit to take on in here. There's somebody to talk to on the far end of this corridor. What are these things? Are, they sh are those pigs? So someone turned the wizards and shit into pigs? Ham witches. Ham witches. All right. Fucking ow. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Also, I just... Veronica wins again. Keep fucking forgetting to switch my camera. Kind of annoying. I need to find a spot where it doesn't look bad and I can just fucking sit there forever, you know? But, like, it can't, like, the entire bottom of the screen is taken up by the UI in this game, unfortunately. Like, I don't know. I mean, I could sit... Uh, like, I could sit over here. I could sit over here, but then you guys wouldn't be able to see health and stuff. And I don't know what's worse. You guys not being able to see health, or... Not being able to see, like, what moves we're selecting and shit, you know? That's a tough one. Center of the screen will work? No, it won't, though, because then you guys, it blocks the dialogue. I don't know. Blue! Blue, how's it going? Pretty good. You almost fell out of your tree and almost broke and sprained your wrist. Well, I'm glad you didn't, Nightwolf. I'm glad you did not. That would have really, really sucked. Oh, shit, it's alive! It's alive! Hold up. Hold up. Say hello to this thing. What the fuck is this? Living statue appears. All right, here we go. All right, this guy is trying to flash us. You guys see this shit? He's trying to fucking flash us. Fucking naughty. Fucking naughty. Naughty, naughty. I hate how the AI picks moves. It almost makes me want to manually do combat all the time, but then that just takes so much fucking... It, may, it takes so much time. I don't think it's worth. I'd rather get through these battles quicker. Victory. Get to the boss fights and the story and stuff. You know what I mean? Uh, Gooey, you're the first Gooman to have visited this place in a long slime. Welcome to the Royal Library, home of the greatest collection of books in all of Erdrea. Since you've come all this way, I'll tell you something really oozeful. This building's like a puzzle box. When you press the gulu wing switches, the walls and staircases spin around and you can goo to different places. But first you got to press this big goo green button next to me. That will activate the switches so you can actually ooze them. Once you've pressed this button, keep your eyes peeled for the other gulu wing uh Goo green switches. God damn it. There's one on this level that will open a way upstairs. Alright, so let's do this. 
activate the shit. Alright. So that does a thing. That does some stuff and thing. The other switches blink to life. Alright, let's find the other switches. Oh, I see one over there. Do that one. Okay. Well, it opened up that passage. I wonder if there's actual books we can read in these bookcases. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. That would be some shit, because it'd be really well hidden then, if so. I'm looking for red books in the bookshelves. Probably not, right? That would be too much bullshit. Oh my god, there is. Look at that. It's over there. It's behind this thing. Hold on. Ah, oh, shit. I activated it. Rip. Fucking rip. Uh, for this little slime? Probably. Probably, Mark. Yeah. This is popular on PS4, or on PlayStation, in general. This whole series is. Alright, let's go. Let's fucking go. Oh no, it's one of these. I can't actually read it. That is some bullshit. I'm probably gonna have to fucking come back and find all those fucking things. There's no way we're doing that, chat. The rewards would have to be, like, fucking insane to actually justify that, you know? 4,000 gold coins. Oh, shit. I did it again. Yeah. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh. I bet this is going to be another one that I can't even read, but we're about to find out, I suppose. You love slimes? You're on a slide about to jizz. Uh, what? What are you going on about, Alec? You're making notes about penises and vaginas and how... What the fuck, Alex? What are you going on about? A book called The Great Guardian of the Hexwood? Ancient legends tell of a mighty and mysterious beast that, leaves deep, that lives deep within the heart. The Hexwood, a frozen forest, and on the snare felt step. Many generations ago, the people of Sniffleheim worshipped this creature as their guardian spirit, and would offer up their thanks for the bounteous blessings they believed it bestowed upon them. Ah, oh, shit, we killed the thing that bestowed bounty upon this region. We're dicks, chat! We're fucking assholes, confirmed. Confirmed. I got gotcha, you, Alex. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> that makes a lot more sense. Shadows? What are we playing, Persona? We did it, darling. Something tells me we're a little bit overleveled. Also, my stuff is like all sorts of angled up here. There we go. Something tells me we are a little bit overleveled. That was a wee bit too easy. Let's see here. Let's see here. What do we got? They're actually not fighting us. They're just kind of leaving us alone, which is kind of nice. Why is Veronica not dead yet? Can't say, Alex. Can't say. The ceiling of the serpent. Long, long ago in the frozen land of the north, there lived a great black serpent that terrorized the people of Sniffleheim. One day, a brave young man came forth and bested the dragon in battle. Having done so, he sealed it away in the ice of the frozen lake of the Snarefelt, such that it could never break free. But that great hero has long since passed away. Should the beast ever escape its icy prison, Sniffleheim will surely fall under its cruel gaze once more. Oh shit. Maybe, that's, maybe we're gonna have to fight it again soon, right? I mean, it would make sense. The kingdom is, uh vulnerable as it's where uh let's see oh i thought that there would be uh an entrance or something there i guess not all right let's see what's over here uh okay it's another one that we can't read this is reminding you of your run through a library and world of final fantasy just one hit to win every fight oh really 
That's weird. That's weird. We're both OP in our uh, library runs. Or whatever the fuck. Urn of Saint's Ashes. Am I defiling a corpse? A storm from the north. Immediately identifiable by their fierce and blood curdling war cry, the vicious Vikings are known to many as the terror of the northern seas. Oh my god, where's Pa? Where is Pa when we need him? They are known for their love of pillage and plunder, and the stories tell of their sailing up and down Erdrea's northern coastlines, bringing chaos and ruin to every town and village in their wake. But such bloodthirsty raiders comprise only a small part of the Viking population. The majority of this hardy people are honest men and women, traitors of considerable uh, competence. That's not Pa. Pa's the former. Pa is the former. <laughs> He's a file to say, oh my god, Alec. Oh my god. Is it? Is he really festive? What? Pa's in jail? <laughs> What? Oh my god, Pa is in jail? Oh shit, I hope he doesn't, uh, I hope he doesn't drop the soap. I hope he does not drop the soap. Alright, uh, should you ever happen to encounter a member of this intriguing tribe, be sure to greet them with a warm smile and a full goblet. Do so and you will be have a stalwart ally for life. Oh my god, that's, that's actually pretty terrible, I hope he's okay. <laughs> That really, really sucks. What's up with this guy? Hi. Are we gonna fight? Let's fight. Let's fight. Uh, a friend of the stream, 007. He's, uh... He's a friend of the stream. Longtime community member. Alright, one of, one of our Norwegian boys. One of our Norwegian boys. One for the good guys. Uh, the way he worded it at first made you think the same thing. He's all right though. Okay, he was just a dumb boy. that talks about his boy pussy too much. Oh my. Oh my. Alex, you're not Norwegian, are you? You're not Norwegian, Alex. All right. Hold up. Oops, I didn't mean to actually get into this fight. <laughs> I'm just gonna let them do their thing. Oh. oh my god. It silenced most of the party. That's some bullshit. That is some fucking bullshit. Yeah, they're called ham witches. Instead of sandwiches, isn't that cute? Pa is also a Swede. For the record, Festive just said that Pa is Swedish. Can we clip this and send this to Pa so he can see it after he gets out? We'll have we'll have festive on the record for saying that. What ten of them are so cute? They are really cute, aren't they? They are very much adorbs. The worst curse. My story starts innocently enough. I was walking through the forest one day when I came across a ledger demon. Uh, he hadn't seen me, so overcome with curiosity, I decided to sneak up and take a peek inside its robes. He tried to look at his penis! Fucking perverts! Oh my god! It noticed immediately and flew into a rage! How dare you try to look at my penis! It bellowed. You'll see soon how much you like my penis! And with that, it stormed off. Ever since that day, my life has been one embarrassment after another. There's not a doubt in my mind that this is the work of the big penis monster and the terrible curse of the penis it placed upon me. When I start my prayers at chapel, I suddenly need the lavatory. If I talk to a lady, I become so distracted that I forget what to say, and in combat I am struck dumb with thoughts of previous failures. Mark my words, dear reader. This is the most embarrassing curse in all of Erdrea. I call it Shypox. Alas, my powers of imagination have been rendered cringe-inducingly weak by it. 
And now, even as I write this, I realize my britches have been unfastened this whole time and my penis flopped out. Truly, this penis curse is a force to be reckoned with. Yikes. Those penis curses, though, chat. Those... <laughs> you love fairy tale readings. <laughs> it makes you hit your toes every step? Oh, God. That's like torture, Alex. That's torture. Oh, this goes up now. Okay, that makes sense. Whoa, what the fuck is this? Hello? Don't mind me, I'm just gonna read a book real quick. What luck! Dagomar finds a recipe book called Favorite Fashions of the Masters of Magic. I learned how to make witches' hat, witches' robes, wizards' robes. Cool. They are having- look, they're having a little school lesson! You know what, we're gonna interrupt school. Class is over, bitches! Class is over! Do 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 do. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. We did it, darlings. All the level ups. All the level ups. Gonna take care of everybody here. I have a feeling that these monsters were like former caretakers of the tower. You know what I mean? Like someone, like someone did this to them, and like we're fucking going around murdering them, and we're gonna be like, oh my gosh, we shouldn't have fucking killed so many of them, or some shit in the future. And don't come back. I'm kind of wondering if that's what's up. Their names are Rectors. Rectally wrecking the Rectors. Get fucking wrecked. <laughs> Sending him that clip, oh my god. It's one day closer to Friday? It is one day closer to Friday. I, too, am excited for the weekend. I have a lot of shit to do between now and Friday, though. A lot of shit. Day after tomorrow, I have a huge demo I'm supposed to do in front of a whole bunch of very important people at work. So, yay. Always look forward to that shit. Oh my god, poisoned it. Nice. Holy shit, Italo! Italo with the five months. Italo, thank you so much. Where does all the time go? Where does all the time go? Five months. God damn, time flies. Time flies. How's it going, man? How are you doing tonight? Uh, Rector's director of probably library directors. Oh, right, 007? Yeah, that makes sense. You have a final on Tuesday. Oh, no, Alex. Finals always make me a nervous wreck. I can feel you on having anxiety about that for sure. Um, there doesn't appear to be anything over here, so we're gonna ignore that, and we're gonna come over this way. Over here. Read this book. Uh, okay, it's in- oh wait. It's magically sealed and I can't read it? Oh shit. Okay, that's something different. I thought it was one of- oh hey, we can go up here. I thought it was one of those where, like... Uh, it's like one of those things we have to come back to later in the story. You know those ones that we've run into? The faded ones? Oh, it's a mimic! Oh, no! TJ! Is it okay to be hiding? Who are you hiding from, TJ? Ow. Fucking ow. Fucking owie. I'm doing really good, Italo. Just keep him very, very busy. Very, 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 very busy. This thing likes to bite me. This is chomping at me. Uh, okay. Ah! 
What is it, Dammy? I'm a mimic furry. Really, Dammy? Really? Okay, I see how it is, Dammy. I see how it is. Gonna take a nice shower? All right, sounds good, man. Sounds good, 007. Enjoy the shower. Get all wet and naked. Like you do. Wonderful. Like you do. Told you I was tough. At least Veronica got a level up out of the fight, so there's that. And we got a seed of skill. All those seeds. And planting all those seeds. I'm not gonna bother that class happening over there. Although I bet you anything that thing's a living statue, so it would be that's like a whole bunch of fights right there. That's crazy. A furry daddy? Oh no. A curious, a curious of the lost kingdom. All right. Many hundreds of years ago, before the kingdom that stood on the site of now what was reduced to ruins, the wizards created some of the most advanced magical devices our world has ever seen. Oh no, I have been turned into a giant furry. The nation's chancellor, in his royal devotion to king and country, invested greatly in the development and distribution of vast numbers of these artifacts, many of which have survived to this day. Among them, perhaps the most commonly encountered nowadays, are the magic doors that protect vaults and strong rooms the world over, and which can only be opened with the fabled magic key. Imagine the bankers and quartermasters dismay when now what fell and the chancellor disappeared forever along with the key they so desperately needed. Rip. Fucking rip. Oh, TJ busting out those cloudy skies. That's crazy, though. They fucking had all those magic doors spread everywhere, and then they couldn't get access to them anymore because they didn't have access to the key. Fucking sucks for them. Fucking sucks for them. All right. We're almost through with this dungeon, I think. Yeah, so that does that, right? Okay. Good, good. Now we need to get back down. I'm gonna go this other way, though, because we haven't actually explored this... We did. Oh, hey, there's a thing. Let me get the chest real quick. Ah, oh, it's one of those fucking living statues over there. Uh, Mercury's bandana? Alright. Then we've already been over there, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure we've already been over there. No books over that way. Just in case, let me come over here real quick. See if I can find anything. I don't really want to miss anything, you know? All right, I don't think we're gonna be missing anything. There, let's go down this other staircase over here. All right, here we go. Because, because Mark, TJ is almost there. Because TJ is almost there. <laughs> oh, that was dirty. All right, let's, let's continue on, yeah? Wait, okay, let's see. Is this something I haven't read yet? Uh, not quite ready yet. All right. <laughs> TJ. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, hey, we can actually make it inside the thing now. All right. Uh, so now we have to go around. Or maybe we have to go up and then over, I think, right? Oh, we have to go the fucking long way, don't we? Oh shit, alright. Go the fucking long way around then. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that's what's up. Let's, uh, let's see here. Do -do -do. Might need to press the thing again. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Let's take care of these shadows real quick. Now Mark can get almost there. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. Oh, why didn't I think of that? That's really good. That's a good one. We need to make it back up and over, I think. I hope I don't have to fuck around with those. Oh, here it is. We did it. We did it. Yes. 